We're in the garden this week for the Movie Minute, and that's because there's the big screen adaptation of Peter Rabbit. Yes, the Beatrix Potter classic, which first came out in 1902, has made it to the shiny big screen with James Corden as the voice of the mischievous Peter. Uh, no new grounds in this. The rabbits are still battling with Mr. McGregor over his vegetables, except Alicia. There's a modern twist. Both Peter and Mr. McGregor have a thing for the neighbor, who's this young, lovely painter who loves animals. So there's a bit of a feud about that, too. I like this movie. I thought it looked great. I mean, I'm not kidding you. These rabbits, if they weren't wearing jackets, you would have thought they trained real rabbits to do this. But we all know that's impossible. Yeah. Liked it. Enjoyed it. Good. No rabbits were harmed in the No, film. no. Okay. All no right. rabbits harm. But there were a few feelings hurt. Talk about the controversy. Yes, there's a scene in the movie where the rabbits um, are fighting Mr. McGregor and they find out that he is allergic to blackberries. So they pelt him with blackberries as you would do with, if you're a rabbit with a blackberry gun. He has to get an EpiPen uh, to obviously stop from going into the shock. And it turns out there's some people out there in the real world that are upset about that, say that's bullying against kids that might have allergies. I guess you leave that to talk amongst yourselves, maybe talk to your kids beforehand, but you carry an EpiPen, what do you think? Ah, oh, blue to the sky, orange to the thigh. And that, <laughs> yeah. Is that, can I okay, say that? Okay, yeah, is it worth the popcorn? Yeah, it's worth the popcorn. I took a six-year-old, she was tickled pink, and I laughed at it too, so yeah, thumbs up. All right, hop to it. There's your movie minute. Hop to it.